Okay, we're up to, we're a little behind, we're up to Tezainam and Beis, in the middle of Shtaris. The idea, if, if, you, if a Shtar is, is lost, whether you return it or not. Now, there's two, two possibilities why you should not return it. One, maybe the halva did not take place. Maybe it was never used. Or two, maybe it was paid off. So when you go ahead and say you return it, it must be we're not crocheted for those reasons, right? Again, those are the two primary reasons. Either it never was supposed to be used, or what, or it, uh, or 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 uh, Yochayis We saw another reason that perhaps you, it was used, but it was it was written one time and Yochayis that the halva took place later on. These are different reasons. So let's start again from the two dots on Tess Zion on the base, about 15 lines down, parallel to the Tess of Safa Pisha Kosovoi Henbeck. Amashmuel. Hamoitzi Shnar Hakna Bishok. Now, Shtar Hakna is where a person went ahead and he said that regardless if the alone takes place or not, whenever it takes place, I'm being mocked into you now. I'm being mocked into you now, this, the she put on this property. So the, the lean is whenever. Whenever the loan takes place, it, the lien is from now. So if the loan takes place in January, the lien is from September. If the loan takes place in August, the lien is from September. That's the Shtar Hakna. So you don't have to worry about that maybe you're going to borrow here and, 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 and they're going to be tired from the Lekuch HaShalei Kedin. You return it to the Bailam. Why? What are you worried about? He was Meshav himself to, to, to go ahead and pay. We're not Chayish for payment. The Misa de Parah, because we paid it off, Mikra Havi Karle, he would have ripped it up. That's Shmuel's din. You know, the fact that it's still in existence screams out that what, that what, that, that it wasn't paid. Um, Rav Nachman, Abba Min Sifri Daini, Demar Shmuel Havi, says Rav Nachman, my, my father was one of the Sifri of the scribes of Shmuel's court. I was like six or seven years old. The Tokarna, and I remember. The Havi Machrozi that he announced, these stories where a person who's mocked uh, the his shibudim to him, the mishtachei b'shukin are do you find in the street? Now, during the Maraya, we turn it to the Malva. So, in other words, it's substantiating Shmuel's din. Amrav Afram, Afan Anami Tanina, and this is where we're picking it up from Friday. Call Maisa Bezdin, any Maisa Bezdin, how you say Yachse, that you can return. Maisa Bezdin, Rashi says, is a Chayra Shta that had a henpick. And as we know by now, a hemp is the authorization of Bezdin. Bezdin went ahead and said, this star went through our, 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 our court, and we went ahead and we have what? We have, what we recognize the signatures and the authenticated the star. So my Bezdin, if you have an authenticated star, you, you can return it. Why? Why is that? Alma, Goloi Chashin Leproyan. Since it went through the court, obviously he didn't go to the trouble of going to Bezdin and not using it. If he's authenticating it, so the cheshat of maybe the halva didn't take place is not existent. And regarding maybe it was paid up, we see that we hold it. We're not chayish, that it was paid up. Because again, it would have been ripped up. Amalei Rav Zeyra Mastison, the story says, says Rav Zeyra, there's no raya from that Mishnah. That Mishnah that we're going to see later on, that Kol Maisa Bezden Yachster, is not necessarily speaking about a shtar pirayin. It could be speaking about a shtar chal and a shtar adrachta. A shtar chal is that when Bezdin sees the guy doesn't pay up, he writes the person a star that gives him a right to go ahead and 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 uh, he's chayv to pay him a field. The star adrachta is that if they can't find the field in his possession now, he can go and look for it. So these are lechavish stories that are not used to peroyin. They're not used to paying up. So you have no raya. Call my Bezdin in the half. I mean, it was a star chayv that had a, a authentic on it. We all know a star chayv is for the collection purposes, and the fact that you go ahead and return it, obviously we're not chayish for a collection. Says the Gemara of you have no raya. It could be speaking about these particular shtaris that are Maisa Bezdin, a star in, in the vernacular, or a star of foreclosure, or a star of, of, of being able to seek out a, a property, and these are not for the Peroyan purposes. And therefore, you have no raya that you're not chayish the Peroyan. These shtaris have nothing to do with Peroyan. Fed Gemara, these have nothing to do with Peroyan. Perish, guys. Let's say, let's say uh, uh, in a scenario where I foreclosed on a loan. Uh, Benji lent me money. I foreclosed on the loan. I don't have the $10,000 to give him. Benji comes to me. He said, this Mishubadim, where... And my and my field now is in the hands of is in the hands of Kenny. 
And so now Benji rips it away from Kenny, right? So Ken, now, okay, so Kenny lost the field again. Kenny's going to come back to me. Now, can you go ahead and ever get the field back from Benji? If I, I would go ahead and, and pay up the loan, could I get it back, right? Could I get it back? And the answer is you could. According to one opinion, up to 12 months. According to the other opinion, you could always get it back. So NIMSA, that this star attracted that, that, or that you collected from is one that is shy to Ryan. If it's lost, the guy can go ahead and say, you know what, I used I used it once to collect the, to, you know, I have it. Let's say I went ahead and I, I paid it off and now I got it back, I lost it. And the guy can say now, Lechaira, you never paid it off again. So Fred the Gemara Kasha, your terrets to that what? That Maisa Bezdin is speaking where it's not a Shtar Peroyin, it's a Shtar Adrachta. A Shtar Adrachta could be a Maisa Peroyin. So, back, so therefore, Lechari, you do have a Raya that when you return it, that you're not Chayish the Peroyin. It would be a Raya to Shmuel. So that's the Gemara. Shmuel said his din that wow, we're not Chayish the Peroyin. We wanted to prove it from the Mishnah later on. We want to disprove it because that star is not collectible. And now we're saying, no, the star is a collectible and it's a good Raya to Shmuel. That's the mechanics of the Gemara. That's the mechanics of the Gemara. Continues the Gemara. We say there, the MS spot, it's not a raya. The MS there, we say the reason why he, the person's mops himself, the bin pare, because when it's paid up, he boiled the Makarvli Shtar, he should have ripped it up right away. Inami, or else let's say the guy says, I don't have the Shtar to rip up. Let's say I don't have it to rip up. Right? That I, he says that what? That I could. Um, Write me another star. Okay, so in other words, I paid up. Rip up the star. I don't have the star. Okay, so write me a, a receipt that I paid up. And when he didn't do that, that's the reason why we're not we're not chayish the proyim. Stam is you are chayish the proyim over there. We're not chayish the proyim because the guy is mafsing himself by not not going ahead and ripping up the star or not having a receipt written that the star was paid up. Uh, now the Gemara now goes ahead and goes back to explain this din of Shuma. Why you have to go back and and pay? The Gemara now is going to say why when you uh, the star mecher on the karka, if you, if you you're writing a star mecher on the karka, and that's going to be returned to the loiva. So, in that case, with me and and and, and Kenny, Kenny, I wrote a star. Uh, Kenny bought it from me, and now it ends up in the hands of Benji because he foreclosed, and now I'm going to go ahead and take it back from. Benji with the money, right? I'm going to buy it back. Where is the Kenyan wisdom? The Shtar over there. It says, with the Medina, Aralei Boy Mahada. Really, Benji could keep it. Benji could keep the land fair and square. He's able to keep it. There's an Indian of doing the right thing, fellas. Even though, even though halakhically uh, you're entitled to it, there's certain, you should do the right thing. Who do the Rabbanon say to return the karka that Benji, Benji should return the karka to me when I pay him the money that I would have, that he would not have been able to take the land initially had I paid him. Hilkach may reishahu de kazavin. Now it's like a sale. Now it's like a, a new deal. It's like a whole, a whole new business deal when the karka is returned to me from Benji. So he boile le mikhtav shtar is the vina. Therefore, I should have gone ahead and asked for a, a star, right? I should have asked for the star. And if I don't ask for the star, I'm the one who's being mastered myself. That's by a, a star, a drachta. Avalgabe, star choiv, by a star, a regular star choiv. Mayakal what are you going to say? Im shema yisaiti pare, if I would have paid it up, i boile le mikri story, I should have written up. Ema ishtamuti kamishtamile, maybe the milva is going ahead and he's saying, I don't have the star. The Amale, the Milva says, I'll give it to you tomorrow. The Hashta, because I don't have it now. Inami is going to say, Avshiti de Safra Zorile. The Malva says he's been typhus the star till after you pay up, and he doesn't want to return it, right? Because he, the, 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 the fellow is waiting for his, his, his money. The cipher is rating for his money. The cipher wants his money. The cipher is going to collect it from the Malba Pashtus, if not, and the Loiv is to write it. The Loiv is to do it. And if you look at Rashi, guys, Inami, go down. Abshita the Safra Zairile, Shala Loiv Alitin Schar Ha Cipher. 
the loyva has to pay off the cipher. Now, the, why would the Malba therefore want to keep the star? And at the time of the alva, the loyva did, didn't go ahead right? and what? He didn't pay the cipher. Who paid the cipher? The Malva. Because the Malva wants, wants, wants the loan to take place, but the cipher didn't have money. So, and therefore, Bishas Salva, he didn't have the money. The Malva paid it up. And the reason why the, the cipher, the Meicher does not, the Malva does not want to give the star back to the Loiva is because he wants him to pay him not only for the halva, but in a, even though he's paying for the halva, he wants him to pay in addition, he wants him to pay the schar of the of the cipher. That, that's the reason, the difference between a shtar adrachta and a shtar chayv. Domelei l'mochri, yavin l'cha, the hashto less a gaboy, it's not here by me, inami, or else, abshiti, the safra, zayolei, he's holding for that reason. Om ravo, om rav yachinan, hamoitzi shtar chayv b'shok, afa pisha kosev by henpik lo yachziru l'bailam. So Rabbi Yechon argues on Shmuel. We began today's shear that Shmuel says that you return it. Good, you return it. And, and he, he argues. He says, you know, return it. You guys, what's, again, what are the two things you're concerned about? Whether the halva took place or whether Yechayish the Parayin. If the henpeck is there, you know for sure that, 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 that it took place. Now, therefore, the only, only thing that you have to take into account whether Yechayish the Parayin or not. So, um, let me buy a delay costed by henpeck. You know to tell me that you don't return it to the Malva even where the henpeck wasn't written because if there's no henpeck, there's as far as to say what it never was a halva. Right? by henpeck and for sure therefore the halva took place. Nonetheless, So you have between Shmuel and Rabbi Yochanan two gedoli 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 amaroyim whether he chayish the proyim or not. Shmuel is not chayish the proyim, thus he can return it to the malva. And Rabbi Yochanan is not chayish the proyim, and therefore you don't return it to the malva. Eisver Yirmiyah le Rabbo, who again Rabbo said this in the name of Rabbi Yochanan, call Maisa Bezdin Harisa Yachzir. Any Maisa Bezdin you return. Now what's Maisa Bezdin? Why do we say henpek? That's a henpek, and nonetheless you see that what you return it. So you tell me you don't. I'm Rabbi Yirmiyah Bray. You said Yirmiyah's son. Loy call my sebes, loy call my not any all my sebes in equal. Loy call my sebes in shavin, not any my sebes in is equal. Ella, when that Mishnah says that you return it, what are we speaking about? This loyva has been established, Karfin. He has previously denied paying. He said, I didn't pay. He said, he said, I paid, and he didn't pay. So, in this case, we're, 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 in this case, we're going to return it to the the Malva, right? Because we don't believe when he we don't believe when he says Perua. You mean to tell me just because he lied once, every single star in the future we're going to say that what wow, you can return to the Malva on the assumption that he didn't pay up just because he did it once? Why you hooks the Karfin all the time? So Rava doesn't like that, Terence. Again, what's the Kasha? Says Rabbi Yochanan, you don't return it. Says the Mishnah, you do return it. Says the Mishnah, our Mishnah is speaking about the hooks of Kafin. Right? Rava, many hooks of Kafin. Just because one time you can say permanently, and therefore you, you're never going to return a star, just because one time. He wasn't hooks on this particular loan. It's not speaking about a star halva, it's speaking about a star atrachta, a star foreclosure, or, or a star that you can go ahead and look for his land, which according to Rebzeira is not a star for Ryan. Therefore, since the mission is speaking about not star parayin, you could return it because there's nothing to worry about. The halva took place. We're not worried about that. There's a henpick on it, and 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 I asking might see bezdin. That's not speaking about a henpick. The one might see bezdin is speaking about a star that is why you can return because there's no no parayin with that star. But now the kafrin hoyel vas in the yada. Since you haven't mentioned kafrin, you mentioned to us kafrin. The name of one so let, let me tell you something about a kafrin where a person denies something. Okay, now, Bezdin says to a guy, two guys, outside guys, two Lashonis, outside guys, eye contact. Say, Tainloi, go pay. Chayev, Ata, you are Chayev. Two Lashonis. Which one is more concrete that you have to pay? It's Say, Tainloi, meaning we've concluded already that there's no other what possibility now go pay chayiv is your chayiv but he didn't tell you to go pay yet so in other words ken zayin 
Right now, Yechayev could be Dingzech. So, two Lishaynis. Say Tainloi and Chayev Ato Tainloi. Ato at, Loi. Says the Gemara. The Amar, so he, he, he was told, say Tainloi. Go ahead, what? And pay. That's what he's told. The Amar, and he says, Karati. He said, I paid. Is that told by the Bezdin? The best, the best. Well, oh, this is all Bezdin. This is Bezdin, right? This is Bezdin, right? And he says, I paid. If you look at Rashi, Karati, Api Bezdin. He says, I even paid in Bezdin. <laughs> Nemon, he's believed with a shvur. He make a shvur hesis that he believed. And the malv is now coming that you should write a shtar adrachta to collect. And right, then we're not going to write it because we assume he paid. However, if he best and tells him to lead in loy, you're chayiv to pay. Beyond a prati, he says I paid. Right, if in other words, if this man he says he said he said I paid, ain't a nemon. Then he's not believed. Because chayiv not necessary, it could be shtumuti sham as we're going to see. Bar milva lichtayiv kaisvin v'noisin la. The milva comes to write a star draft. We'll write it. Rav Zid Mishmei Rav Nachman Amar bein seitain loy bein chayiv at li tain loy v'amet prati nemar. He's going to believe either way. He argues, he argues on 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 Rav Nachman. He says even say even even chayiv at li tain loy he's believed. Even they is believed, right? You're not going to go ahead nice So what's the chilik between between seitain leiv and It either way the loiva is believed. What's the difference between chayiv and and say? Hachi the seitain leiv v'amet prati. But Adam and Adam especially Paru and Adam testify that he didn't pay up. Then huchse kafrin loyse mamin. Right then he's then he's huchse he's he's muchse because the kafrin that money. In other words, we don't trust him anymore. However, if he the best and says and then he says I paid up, they didn't eat him the oysish lay par and they didn't testify he didn't. The chaz of Amar Prati loy hichse. He's we're not mukzak that he's a kaf from loysim mamin. My timer is namuti chodem shdamit. When he just said chayiv ato li tein loy, he not he's he's waiting and biding his time. Savar ad ma'aini be rabbanim bedina till the chachamim look in the din better. So that's the chilik according to according to. Um, Revs Vid, right? But that's that's the, that's the chilek according what to 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 Revs Vid that say tzein loy you hooks a kafrin chayiv atalit tzein loy even though you 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 denied and you lied we're not hooks a kafrin why because you're just buying time. Amar Rav Rav Chana Biyachinon someone says manali biyadcha baloy am am ma in lecha biyadik klum I have nothing in my hands but either may either may say she yesh loy the chaz of Rama Parati hooks a kafrin loy semamin. He then he's chusik kaf in the rov. Mom, he's gonna have to pay up. Ki hod the shabt toy bereid the rav meinus. Shabtsi the son of rav meinus. Kosev lo lekalasa. He wrote his daughter-in-law. It's lo the milsa b'ksubasa. He wrote ahead in the ksuba. He wrote in the ksuba. He wrote that you know as a tosefis ksuba for his son. He wrote, "I'm gonna give you a fine wool coat." And the kibla aleha. And he was makabel as again. He's not. He's an orev. He's the orev to ksuba. Guys, he does the ksuba. It's a son. It's his daughter-in-law. It's not his wife. And it's macabre that he's going to pay it up. She wants to claim the coat. He says, No, it's like I paid up. I ne- it was, never was. Us Adam came along and said, In Kosovo, right? He said that what that you did write it. In the end, I paid it up. And he has to pay up that coat. He says, I swore. And Aiden swear that he didn't. Then he won't be, we, won't, we won't let him make that shua. So, in other words, if he's a shua to get off the hook, guys, the other one would be, be, he be, would swear connected him to be Machayat and to pay. When we, is he hooks the kafrin? That's why shua is best then. If the guy he he initiates it. And he says, "I'll swear neman." Then he's believed to say that one. Uh, he's he's believed because of an inch did It's right. It's about a person would go ahead and, and say if, if he's mechayiv shul himself. Then he's believed because that seems to be a style to be convince somebody. I drew a kameid the rabbi and amal who I know nami bez and nami. I also only said a shvur is bez then. Then he's chuchz the kafrin, but if it's sure that al piatzma is not chuchz the kafrin on that shvur. 
It may not be above, I'm below, I'm Rabbi Yachnan, how you high look of every shua, the best of persons high of shua and best in the Amenishpati, they didn't eat them, I say shalain nishpa, they swear that what they didn't, hooks the car from the rest of Again, it was shua, only shua of best in. I'm Ravasi, I'm Rabbi Yachnan, how might you start high be shook? Someone finds a star high in the street, the cost of by Enpik, the cost of by is manoi, by by yoin. So now, on April 7th, you find the star in the street, there's a henpick on the star. Now, what did Rabbi Yechelen say, guys, earlier? He said, you don't return it, right? Rabbi Yechelen says, you don't return it. Shmuel says, the one you return it. Rabbi Yechelen says, you don't return it. Here, Rabbi Yechelen says, you would return it. Why? Because since it's dated that day, we're not chayish that that day he paid up. Rabbi Yechelen again said that if you, you find the star, again, there's two things to be chayish. This whole sugya, there's one, two things. One, did the loan take place? When you see the word henpek, it means the loan took place. It's now, Chayish the Parayin, Machloikis. Said, said Shmuel, you're not Chayish the Parayin. Said, said Rabbi Yochanan, you are Chayish the Parayin, and, and you won't give it back. However, there is a Hechet Timsa, there's a case where Rabbi Yochanan says you would give it back. What's well, that case? Where the, the star is, the, you, I, 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 I borrowed $10,000 from Benji on April 7th. It's, you find the star in the street. Said Rabbi Yochanan, stern and pay up. There's no way a person is going to borrow money in one day and pay up in one day. It doesn't, doesn't make any sense. So therefore, he rebuilt and in that case, we're not we're not chayish the proyin, and you return it to the Malvi, you return it to Benji. Says the Gemara. The Kasab by Bismani, boy by Yoy Maxir Labayla, you return it to the Malva. Imushim Kasab Lilvois Loy Loiva. If you're worried about what the Alva not taking place, a Kasab boy handpick, you have a handpick written in there. Imushim Peroyin, the Priya Basyam, Le Kashina, you're not chayish the proyin on one day. Omer of Zayr, the Rev Asi, me Omer of Yachin Hoki Ha, Haatu the Armit Mishmed of Yachinon, Star Shaloiva boy, Upora. In the of a loyva boy, a star that you lent with, you can't use it a second time. Check for a nimfl shibudai because the lien that was on the first that was on the first loan does not work for the second loan, right? Amos, when exactly is that speaking? Ilayma lemachar uli machara. If you're saying it's for a star, you you want to use the star for another day or the day after that. My area check for a nimfl shibudai. Why do you care that it's nimfl shibudai? Typically, the havile muktim. Right, guys, watch. I have a star. It's dated April 7th, right? I can't use that star twice. Why can't you use that star twice? Why? Why can't you use the star twice? Is because on the first loan, it was written for that first loan. And let's say I go ahead and re-borrow from Benji my money. It's now a Milval Pet. So there's no Shibudim there. It's, it's in the Milval Pet. The star doesn't work on the second loan. Says the Gemara, that's the reason why you can't use it a second time. Because if Benji goes ahead and collects with the star from Kenny, he won't be correct. Because I paid off that first loan. The first lien to Kenny was, was off already. Good. Now, let's figure out what's going on over here. Let's say I, on Sunday, I paid off the loan. On Monday, I need the money again. And Benji says, no problem. We have a star. We'll use it again a second time. That star is a star muktim because it's dated from Sunday. Fred Gemara Kasha, why the reason why you can't use the star again, right, is because why? Because in the Michael Shibudo in the first loan, if it's on another day, it must be a star muktim. So you won't need it in a vat of a Nimcha Shibudo. So it must be that what? I'm reborrowing the money from, from Benji on Sunday, that same day. Let's see it inside. Says the Gemara Geshmak. Says the Gemara Geshmak. I'm going to say a little Asi. Me on Rabbi Yochan Hachi that you're, you're not chayish that a person would pay up. Like, therefore, you would return the star. So let's say that in our case that you would return the star to Benji on that day because there's no way I paid up on Sunday. But at who the army is made Rabbi Yochanan, you Rav, you Rav Asi said in the name of Rabbi Yochanan, Shtar Shaloi Vaboi, a Shtar that was used for Halva, Uparoi, and was paid up, ain't a Chayzim Loi Vaboi, you can't use it a second time. Shekvay Nimfla Shibudoi, because the Shibud on the first loan is gone. Amos, exactly when is that talking about? Amos, when are you speaking? Ilay Melamachar, Uli Yumachara, if you're saying for the debt on Monday or Tuesday, Yoy Machar means the day after that. My year is Shifra Nicha Shibudoi. What's the reason you can't use this? Because the Shibud is gone. 
Taping late the Havile Muktum. The star was dated on Sunday, and now it's Tuesday. Bitanan, Shtori Chava Muktum and Psulim. Ah, El Olav, it must be, Biyume. It must be that what? That you paid that day. Alma Pari Inish Biyume. Kasha. Al Malay. So he said, Rabasi answered, Mika Amina, the Lay Pari Klal. I never said they never play at all. It's not shyish. It's not. It's not common, guys. Obviously, if you ever borrowed money, unless you won the lottery that day, you're not paying back the money on that same day, right? I it may happen. In, 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 it may happen. In, in, in I had a misa, I think, where someone paid me back. I I lent the money, and they paid me back that night. They said that the money came in from somewhere. Most of the time, I don't get paid back at all. <laughs> That's the truth. Most of the time, I don't get paid back at all. By the way, you should always know when a person wants to borrow money, if you ever get it back, it's like you have to have in mind that you're not going to get it back. That's as serious of the case. Most time, people are unfortunately unable to pay back. But anyway, so the answer to the kasher is you're right. The case of using the star twice is taka case where you pay back on that day. And therefore, you can't use it the second time because it's Michael Deshiba from the first loan. I, it's a proof that you could pay back on the same day. But that's not common. It's not common enough that if you find the star in the street with a handpick dated that day, it's enough of a reason to say that you're not Chayish the Peroyen. And in Svarah, that makes a lot of sense, right? In Svarah, that makes a lot of sense. And none of these, none of these Gemaras are easy Gemaras. They, you know, they're very uh, few people have mentioned it to me. Rav Kahana Omar, Rav Kahana said, Kishachayiv Moida says Rav says Rav Kahana. What's this case speaking about? What's what's the, what's the case speaking about? Where you're going to return it? You want to know where you, you want to know when you're going to turn it? You have you have a steer in Rabbi Yochanan. Rabbi Yochanan says that what your Rabbi Yochanan says you're not you're not Yechayish the Proy and you don't return it. And then it says what you do return it. Good. It's when the Chayiv is Moida. He's Moida that it took place. Says the Gemara. So Ihachi, if the is moida, that he didn't pay up, what's the Kiddush? Of course he returned it, right? So Maudatema, I might think, hi, this loiva mifra priya, he did pay up. And why did he say I didn't pay up? Because he wants to go and use it a second time. In other words, guys, this this there are um if any of you have done transactions, you bought a house, sold a house, there's always <laughs> There's always, all of a sudden, you go to a closing and you think it's X amount of money, and all of a sudden, there's there's a title search and there's this and there's that. I sold my house. There was a mansion tax. I mean, you can't believe what's my mansion. That it was, but you know, they stuff is like a mansion. It's it's unbelievable. But so, in other words, it behooves the liva to go ahead and use this star again. So guess what? I paid off Benji, but I'm gonna need the money again. So. Why bother with the fees of Bezdin and Seifrim? So that's why I said, that's why I said I didn't pay. Be able to, to have to have a viable star. So it's the Gemara. That, that's the Kiddush over here. So therefore, I'm I would say, Mifra Pare, the Loiva paid up. Behind the Ka'ama Loi Parite, and that said he didn't pay up. Mishim the Kaboy Mahadel, the Misse Bezim Nachriti, wants to borrow a second time. Will the Pshite the Safri Chayash, he doesn't want to pay up the legal fees of the Seifrim. Mash Malan. The Imkain, Malva Gufa Leshavik, the Malva Benji's not going to let it go. Why? The Sava Shamile Rabbanon will mostly be. In other words, the Rabbanon are going to hear about this and will be Mavsa to the So therefore, Benji's not going to allow. And therefore, you can return the Shtar and therefore not what? My Shnama Hadithna, the Gorm wants to know what's the difference in Am Mishnah? Matsu Shtari Choiv, Im Yesh Behem, Achrayas Nechosim. We had this earlier. If you find the Choiv in the street and have Achrayas Nechosim, Lo Yachsa, you don't return it. Who Kimno, we said it's speaking Kishachai of Maida. Remember, we had Machloikis Reb Meya and the Chachamim, remember that chart? And uh, and, and the Chachamim said that the Chayas the Parayin, and even if he's Maida, who Kimno Kishachai of Maida, Mishim Shema Kosav, Lulbais Benissim, Vlelova Atishrei. What are you worried about? Maybe it's a Shtar Mukdim. We also literally the Kuchish like Minissim Vatishrei, Shlaika Din. We don't say, Dim Kain, Malva Gufa, Leshavik. So what's the difference over there? You don't return it because the Malva is not going to leave it. Oh, over here, Mashenkin, you will return it because the Malva would, would not be happy. 
the Amalei, the Malva says to the Loiva, Kosev Shtar Achrina, B'Tishrei, right? Another Shtar in Tishrei, the Dilma, Shomir Rabbana, maybe the Rabbana will hear him, so you have the Kasha. He just told me that the Malva is, is not going to go along with any hanky-panky because he's worried about losing the Shtar. So that's the case over there. What are we worried about? He, he, you found the Shtar that we had Achrayas Nechasim. He's moida that thought that he didn't pay up. And we don't return it because you worry that what? That maybe the halva is stated in, in, in Nisin and it, it's going to take place in Tishrei. Why would the Malva? Maybe the Malva won't go along with that. And so therefore, there's not, you should be able to be, return it, right? Because the Malva is not going to go ahead along with the lie of the of the Laiva because he's scared about the Chumri maps at him. Ami Chassam over there in that Mishnah, Mishum de Islay Ravka. There's a there's a, a revach to collect the star mukdim, the katarif lekuchais minisim at tishrei. They're collecting for six a six month period, so and therefore minay nichale for the the it, it's good. The leyam of leymidi. He's not going to go ahead. What uh, the malb is not going to say anything because he has a period of time. But hacha, but this star we moichel in in such a short period of time, keeping the less leyravka to go ahead and to return and loan him again. The slave slave shtara idnuksiv, the star is written now, my ikka, my, my ikka, what do you gain with this star, the katar of Lukuchis? Over there he has something to gain. Why does he have that six month period? Over here he's gaining one day, he's nothing. So bishtar shinim he's not going to allow it. Amr Abkhiya Baraba, Amr Abyakanon, Hatoyim Prati, a person goes ahead and says, Prati, I paid up. Acha my Sebastian, right? If the if uh, let's say ksubasisha, my sebastian ksubasisha or mezainasisha that you have to go ahead and provide for the kids after his death, amid beis, leim aklum. So a person says on a my sebastian, he says I I paid up. Leim aklum, he didn't say anything. My timer, call my sebastian, command the nachet star be on it, dummy. Call my sebastian. It's if, if what they're holding on to a star. Let's see Rashi. But uh no, that's not the Rashi. So uh, it's like you're holding on to a star. The people. It, it's like if you paid up, you have to prove it. In other words, you have to if you paid up the, the Muslim and all this stu stuff, it's like they're holding on to a star, and therefore you're not believed to say I paid up unless unless you have some a proof. What are you what are you telling me? What is what is Rabbi Yochanan telling me? It's a Mishnah. It's a Mishnah. What does Mishnah say? get If a person a, a woman Produces a get and there's no ksuba, go with ksuba, so it's enough to collect the ksuba. So you see that why it's like she's holding on to ksuba. Says, if I didn't pick up the, the shard of, of earthenware, when Mishkachas Maganisa to toy, you wouldn't have found this pearl underneath it. In other words, I, I gave you the reason over it. The reason why, if you produce a get, you collect the ksuba, it's like you have the star in your hand. So I'm going me, Maganisa. Don't live in Makam Shen Kaisen Ksuba. Maybe what's the what's the big jewel over here? Maybe it's spe speaking in a place where they write a Ksuba. Only the Slimech on Bezdin. That Rashi says. Makam Shen Kaisen Ksuba. Top Rashi. El Slimech on Tanai Bezdin. The Slimech on the Tanai Bezdin. That Bezdin always wrote Mizoynis for the woman and and as long as they're in the house. The Tig Bala Oila Machiyotzi Abal Shoyver the Get until the Bal produces a receipt. Shemayet Shigir Shluhu Shemachia Shachai Vula Ksuba. So maybe it's speaking, what's your raya that it's like holding on to a star, like you're holding on to a suba. Maybe it's a place where they didn't write a ksuba. The whole proof is that you have a get, and it's like you're holding on to a ksuba. What's your raya? Maybe it's a place that they didn't write a ksuba. In other words, what, remember, guys, we had a ksuba. You remember, okay. I barely remember. <laughs> in ksubas, we had, guys, in, in ksubas, we had the shaila. Why would it be a place that, who's the onus on to this proof? Who's the onus on, right? If you write the ksuba, the woman's got to watch it. If you don't write the ksuba, then it's the onus is on the man. He's going to have to have a shoiver that what he paid up the ksuba. So who that was that was the sugi there in in ksubas. So maybe this place is speaking where you don't write a ksuba. If it's a place you don't write a ksuba, you have no right. I speak that my sebes is like a type of ksuba dummy. Place they wrote a ksuba, maybe she can't collect. So you have no right. My sebes is like type of ksuba, like a type of star. Adam Rabbi Elad Milsi. Not Rabbi says I'm wrong. Enochinami. I see a get. It's like you're holding onto a, a ksuba, and therefore you can collect it. It's like you're holding on, onto a, a, a star. So I'm wrong, right? That because the isal kedaita of makom shein koysim ksuba. If you think it's a place where you don't write a ksuba, askinon al v'makom she koysim ksuba i nakit ksuba gavya iloy lo gavya. In other words, but in a place where they write a ksuba, then yes, yes, not not. 
Me, Amon, and Erisin, the my Gavia. Now we know by 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 now we should know there's two parts to to marriage. Erisin, they were married for a year. They lived apart, and then the suin when it goes in the rishus, if 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 she if he dies during that twelve month period, they never lived together. There's ksuba. This is ksuba. This twelve month period is ksuba. So Amon and Erisin, the my Gavia. What is she going to collect with? She doesn't have ksuba. It must be 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 a day misas bal. Litoin v'leima paraiti. Let let the yarshim say it's paid up. Let the yarshim say it's paid up. Ella must be that what that they they'd have to produce the shaver because why? Because it's like they're holding on to a star. You don't pay up. By saying that such a thing is a is a is a ksuba for for um, almana from an erison. How do you know that such an animal exists? How do you know such a thing? Maybe only by chupa. You collect everything. You collect not only the ksuba, but you collect the best in anything written in the ksuba. That's where he wrote it for her. But you know, you have no raya that. Maybe this guy happened to write it, but not everyone writes it. That you do not collect the Tosefis Ksuba. That if she's divorced or, or uh, married or divorced from Gerishin, she doesn't collect the tesefis of the ksuba because we say we say that watch like that he didn't go ahead and write it up. Ella must be almanas the koinsa. It's circulated. The kiddush is that he married her on the on, to, to, on the condition that if he divorces her that what that she doesn't get kesefis ksuba. The fikach that's 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 the dinner of Elazar Zaria. The fikach therefore it's trichale. You need the time of the mission to tell me we're not chayish for that. So therefore, obviously, obviously, but you don't know, have a riot that this is a place that you that you write a, a super for Alamana. They Nami, the mission is speaking where he wrote it, guys. In other words, it's not automatic, but he wrote it. Diktani, Goiva Esakol. They collect everything, even to the Sefes. He I mean Bishlema, the mission is speaking the Kosovo, the Balwater Ksuba, Haim Diktani, Goiva Esakol. You know what that means? The Ika Ksuba and the Tisefes. If you're saying that it's just automatic, right? My guy was a call. Manu misayim who the islay. Perish, guys, outside. You want to know? We digress now. You want to know? There's something a uh, ksuba for almana or gerusha. You bring a mishnah and you, and you say over there. You see that it says over there. And this almana is gashu guy was a call. What does guy was a call mean? You collect a hundred or two hundred, depending on what, what, whether the shuba is an almana or a, a basula. And in addition, you collect a tosefes. If you want to bring me a raya. That you write that outright. Why would you say Tisephus? No one, not everyone writes Tisephus. Automatically, it's 100 or 200, right? Who writes Tisephus? Obviously, someone who wrote the Ksuba himself. So that's your Raya that that Mishnah is speaking about, where he on his own initiative wrote it. But no Raya that every single Amana or, or get or, or Amana or Gerusha who gets married. Well, I keep on saying that if, if from Arison gets a ksuba, it's no raya. That whole Mishnah is speaking we want, he wrote it. And the raya that he wrote is Goyve es hakol. It doesn't say Goyve es ksuba. So Goyve es hakol, even if I accept the ksuba. And we'll pick it up here tomorrow. Well, let's say a capital hill.